Okay, here's my new all-in-one cell. This is the uh, fuel cell section here, and the water reservoir here, and your gas outlet here, and then you got your filler neck here. Now all you have to do, you got your PWM over here, we got it hooked up to the battery, and then we'll go around here, and the PWM with the master switch is over here. And this is all preset. We got this thing running. It's a 10 amp cell. We got it running at 10 amps. It's got the low water uh, sensor in here, so if it runs low water, it shuts the entire system down. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and start my car up. It's gonna make a lot of noise, so just bear with me. It's not running. You can see the amp meter. I don't know if you can see the amp meter. It's not uh, showing anything. I'm going to turn on the master switch. Okay, the amp meter shows zero amps. Uh, it's got a one minute delay, so you don't pull, pull or truck run your battery. So we're going to wait uh, for one minute to come on. Got uh, all the, the fuel cells that. Four gauge wires hooked up here. And on the back side, I don't know if you can see that back there, but on the back side, it's just four gauge wires hooking it up. We're going to have a one minute delay on there so you don't want to run the blow plugs and the fuel cell at the same time. And all you have to do is hook this up, is like I say, hook this, these two up to the battery, and this one here wire goes to the uh, oil pressure switch. Okay, if you're, okay, now we got 10 amps. This came on, 10 amps. And there's your production. Can you see the production here? And I'm going to come around the side over here and look at it from this angle. This is going from this angle over here. Thank you. Production, hydrogen production. So that's all you have to do. You have two wires here, one wire here for your, your uh, air pressure switch and your hose to your intake and the gun. All in one, plug and play, ready to go. End of story.